So we're gonna do a view. This is a gold dot, 124 grain hollow point, loaded with unique powder. I think the load data is uh, we're 5.6 grains of unique powder, 1.12 overall length inches. Of course, uh, we're gonna be shooting these across the chrono and into these jugs here. I hope that this works. We got good shot placement. We measured a 1056. Let's check this out real quick so I can get my chrono and everything out of the snow. So obviously we went through one on the ground, went through two, went through three. It looks like we stopped there. I do not see any puncture marks on the third or even an exit. It looks like we started to exit maybe here on the fourth or the third. Me. Let's check that bad boy out. Oh yeah, there it is. It's way over there. You see it down in there? Let's dump this out real quick. Oh yeah. Check out that expansion. There we go. It's gold dot, 124 grain, shot out of a 3.3 inch barrel. XTS traveling at 10. What did our chrono say here? Let's check this out again. 1056 there. All right, here we go, take two. We're gonna do this again, uh, just for fun, and also uh, see if we duplicate the results. Oh yeah, good deal, we clocked that. See the Kearney. Uh, it's 1070 and I got water even over here on the camera so, uh, Let's go check it out. Oh man, I think I already had two jugs here. So I think we went through uh, One two jugs into the third here Here's your third jug Looks just like last time I think we went through three jugs We stopped here. Let's see if we can find it uh, in here in the third one what can I do? There she is down there. All right, good deal. We captured it. Third jug. All right, there we go. Damn, some really good expansion there. I guess that's why uh, so many people like the gold dots. These are expensive bullets, 25 cents per bullet. I'm not talking about per round, 25 cents per bullet. I mean, you can find them cheaper some places by the time you add in shipping or tax. About 25 cents per bullet. All right, now I'm just gonna shoot a few real quick uh, over here to try to fill the recoil. One twenty-three grains, change weight, and the other one is uh, twenty-four point two. One twenty-four point three. It's really good on the retained weight. And these are the uh, gold dot. Twenty-four grain. There it goes. So gold dot, one hundred twenty-four grain. They're coming a hundred per pack. Uh, Usually it's at around 20 25 cents per bullet. Uh, find them. It's fun, you can find a relay that works well for your your pistol. And adjust uh, everything from the, uh, the amount of powder to control the amount of recoil and all those things, but still uh, maintain expansion. So that's pretty low velocity. Well, I'm a thousand. It's not horrible. It's actually not bad for. 24 grains, so we got a 3.3 inch barrel. It did kick pretty good, and when I was shooting it, I mean, you could feel it kicking in your hand. When I use my light reloads, um, you don't feel it, but I could feel those a little bit.